everyone, so here we are again with another subscriber Pokedex video. Let's get into it. This one happens to be another starter series, Squirtle, War Turtle, and Blastoise. Um, and this one has a special place in my heart because Squirtle was my very first Pokemon on my very first Pokemon adventure with red version. Which kind of seems strange to start red version with the water type, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> anyway, I had a lot of fun with this one. Squirtle's in such a cute pose and I had a really fun time drawing his toes for some reason. <laughs> His toes are really cute to me. Um, and for some reason, whenever I draw Squirtle or Wartrel or Blastoise or really anything with a turtle shell, it always kind of confounds me. Uh, turtle shells are really not that easy for me to draw for some reason. I think it's just all the different like hexagonal shapes all over their backs. So it kind of challenges your skills with perspective, if you know what I'm saying. I did happen to make one mistake, though. <laughs> because there was painter's tape in the way, I couldn't tell that the area I was painting was actually part of Blastoise's shell. <sighs> of course, I mess up on one of the very few spots that's white. Of course. It looks okay. It's not terrible. What are you doing, Zoe? Oh. Okay. Uh. Thanks. Yeah? <laughs> okay. Get down. Please. Don't put your butt on the painting, please. There we go. We're gonna pick you up now. <laughs> Okay. I did use two different blue colors for Blastoise and War Turtle, but they kind of look the same. Uh, I went over War Turtle again with a little bit of more purpley color, but he really does look very similar to Blastoise's blue, but that's okay, I guess. It still stands out. They all have different color brown shells. They all use different shades of blue for their skin. I'm having a lot of fun painting these and I really hope to keep this momentum up and go through the entire Pokedex because like when I first thought of this idea I was kind of like well you know it'll probably become a grind at some point and in all likeliness it probably will become a grind but I'm still having like so much fun with this I've drawn a bunch of them already <laughs> and I just want to keep going it'll be great so I'm really excited. I hope you're excited too. The more subscribers I get, the more Pokemon paintings I'll do. So uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe if you want to see more of these Pokemon paintings. Uh, leave a comment down below if you like something or if you have any questions or tell me what your favorite Pokemon is or anything at all. I like comments and questions. Oh, and if you really want me to get to a specific Pokemon, the best way to help out is to spread the word. You can link this video or uh, share my playlist to your friends, and the more people that subscribe, the more paintings I'll get to do. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hopefully will see you all in the next video. Bye!